Hello everyone. In this video I'm going to show how to use Power BI mobile app. Power BI has three different services. The one of the services is Power BI online service where you can create your own reports, dashboards using different data source connectors. It can connect to the online premises as well as Azure data sources. Even it has desktop version as well. In desktop version you can create your reports with the different data source connectors connectors and even you have a more uh, features on data modeling and even uh, there are a lot of customized features for uh, reports uh, charts there are many features which you can design in a desktop version and you can publish to the online services so once you have published you can access those reports or dashboards in online uh, through browser or even you can access those reports dashboards in power bi mobile app i'm going to show how to show those reports or dashboards in a mobile app first we need to install power bi mobile app so just go to play store and type it for power bi and you can see this symbol uh, yellow color symbol and download that so once you have downloaded you can see these options so I just downloaded now so these are the just help functions and these are the power bi samples which you can see in a mobile app so I'm going to show get started and here we have two options so using this power bi mobile app we can connect power bi services or we can connect SQL server 2016 reporting services so reporting service is one of the uh, uh, add-on for SQL server so you can create a reports on SSRS uh, reporting services till you can access those reports in Power BI mobile app now I'm going to access my reports and dashboards which is available in Power BI click Power BI and type your uh, email account and click sign in so it is going to verify your email account whether it is available or not once it is verified you, you have to give the password click sign in ok so now it is loading now it is going to load all my dashboards reports which I have created start exploring so these are the dashboards available in my power bi account and even I can see the reports so dashboards are nothing but it's just a, a collection of uh, report elements which is coming from different reports so usually we will be creating a reports first and while opening the report we have option to click that particular report item to show as a dashboard so we can create a single dashboard with uh, different number of uh, report elements from multiple reports so apart from that we have a workspace yes actually all these reports will be available on a container called workspace so you can create a different different workspaces on each workspace you can have a different uh, dashboards and reports now i have a only one workspace which is called my workspace so underneath this workspace i have all these dashboards and reports so if you have a different workspaces those workspaces will be listed out here and you can go to that particular workspace and you can see their reports and here you can see my profile information and the notification there is no notification favorites so if you make any of the, your reports or dashboards as a favorite then those will be displayed here and workspaces and scanner even you can ask, do the scanner uh, QR code scanner and you can have that information here and apart from that here we have a settings so here as I said we have 
different uh, in from different accounts one is power bi and another one is connect to sql server so if you have a sql server credentials you can connect that information via uh, passing server address username password so that will be connected so you can parallelly access both power bi reports dashboards as well as your ssr uh, reporting services dashboards and reports so now we will go back to the dashboards and reports so i'm going to show one of the uh, dashboard here you have two options uh, refresh sorry and uh, you can make it as a favorite or even you can invite your colleague to see or access these reports so i'm just opening this uh, class teacher dashboard here we have a, a dashboard for uh, school administration attendees and uh, the same look and feel which you created on a power bi services or powered bi desktop application so you can easily access that even you can click this uh, particular uh, report element you can see in detail even uh, you can share this directly from this uh, particular window you can on it uh, you can add some text on this and you can share it to anyone and even you can uh, actually as i said these dashboards will be coming from any of the reports so from this particular window i can go back to the uh, reports so if i click that uh, that right hand side uh, mark it is going to show my report so in this particular report i have a different visualization so now you can have a better understanding so from this report i just marked this particular attendees pie chart as my one of my report element for my dashboard but when i go back to the report i can see all these visualizations even it has some filter so the facility which you are working on a power bi service or desktop all applicable on this mobile app as well you can go to the next one and you can see uh, the different information let me show a different dashboard so this is the one i just created uh, based on my expenses so i have a different uh, visualization so due to some issues it is loading late and from here i can uh, pass it to anyone i mean i can share these reports to anyone or directly i can access uh, reports doesn't have any report on the sample okay we will open such a report so yeah so this is a report uh, here i have a different uh, pages so i can go to page by clicking this page option and i can select uh, which page i want to move and i can see the information right thank you